Yes, this is the plan. But we've got a game. We got a game. We got a game. I am in the economy slot ish. I am here. Listen up, primitives. This is my boomstick. But it's not my boomstick juice. <laughs> Please don't cook in you all blame blue owl. So you know I've got I've got floss. I got something. I've got Jonas, Wedge W, and Amster. Which means all the other guys are on the enemy team. Oh god, I've got Jonas in air. <laughs> oh, this is gonna go poorly. Hi Jonas! Do you know how to play air? Love you too, Jonas. to be a rehost. Right, what's this dude's name? Nea Begolia. Alright. Okay, hold on. How do I... Okay, private message. Okay. I'm gonna walk my commander pretty early. Like, I'm gonna, yeah, factory walk. Not factory walk, but like. Clicky, clicky, click. Not gonna hyper invest. This, he says potentially hyper-investing and stuff. Get the show on the road. I want two more engineers from this. And then we're getting units rolling. In fact, we're going to get units rolling right the heck now. Gosh hecky. Give me Brecky. Which is different to, like, give me Becky. Becky someone else. Good on power? I don't know. Uh, 
I'm getting two hydros, so that should be something. I feel like I should be forgiven if I state the fact that I'm not entirely too certain if I trust our 1400 with like five games. For obvious reasons. I've run out of mass with this uh, T2 upgrade, T2 Max upgrade. That may have been a mistake. That was probably a mistake. Okay, let's cancel that. Or not cancel it. God damn it, Floss, you took my mix. <laughs> <laughs> you betcha I wanted that. <laughs> no, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, keep it. <laughs> it's fine. I'm just poking fun at you. Clicky on the reclaim. Those are enemy units. That's a Yurka. Hello, Yurka. What you doing here? Hey? What you doing? Such a silly bean. Having a commander. Post weight grilled cheese. E yes. Question mark. I don't know if this is a normal thing or if this is just something that feels aggressively American. Post weight lifting grilled cheese. I feel like it's something that just feels aggressively American. For another subscription. Thank you very, very much. How you doing, friend? How are you doing? I am power stalling. Hmm. This is this is peak gameplay right here. Although maybe I am not power stalling anymore. Where did I get the power from? I suppose one of yeah, one of these PGens must have finished building. <laughs> it's like, well then, well, that works. Now I'm power stalling. Hmm. Yes. What in the shit is this? 
Okay. Maximum meme, maximum kick. Don't know if it's aggressive American or not, but you saw two grilled cheeses before you started lifting. You washed the dishes between sets, the sandwich being cooked on the lowest heat setting. Yep, nope, that is aggressively American. That is easily one of the most American things I've heard. <laughs> it's like... I was lifting weights while making food. Sniper convoy. Shoot things with alacrity and range. Come on, versus. Let's see, Yurka. Hello, friend. I have a lot more units than you do, I think. I want to keep a PD to fall back to. It's already being built. Oh, that's two commanders. That's a Regal. Hi, Regal. Commander under attack. I have units. Like a lot of units, actually. And you've gone T two. Interesting decision. <laughs> I'm backing up, I'm backing up. I just wanted to see if I could poke him. Insufficient radar. Yeah, it's going. It's shame works. No, it doesn't. Hey, Jonas, do you think we can do something in regards to plasma on the right hand side?
Oh, I turned repeat build off, actually. I'm only building five. Bye. I'm explicitly building a small value. Wait, who just died? What? Uh oh. Someone on their team, cool. I... I care not for this. <laughs> okay, let me take my commander and go help Floss. Floss, be careful. You are versus Plasma. <laughs> who is not an opponent to be trifled with. Thank you very much for the follow. Hope you're having a good evening. Maybe I won't go and help. Commanders are slow. <laughs> that's that's all my, my fault is. Commanders are slow. Yeah. Commanders, yes. Commanders are, yeah. Let's turn that off. Um, I don't believe there's any more reclaim for me to go and get, which is a bit frustrating. So, we will just continue upgrading stuff. Hey, yourself! Oh, we no longer need that. So we can grab this, grab this. Um, what else can we grab? What else can we do? What shenanigans can we get up to? It's just fire basing. Walk forward and make sure. Make your own reclaim. I, I don't know, I kind of feel like I'd rather just give up that mid set. I'm going to try and make the jump to T3, I think. Sit that there. I don't want to get into a beauty wall with you. I really don't. Like, that's not something that appeals to me. Appeal. But I might not have a choice? Shrine on the left hand side. Hmm. Oh, it's not just purple, it's regal as well. Regal's also PD creeping me. Which is why I'm kind of thinking maybe I can make go T3 and just get Artie. Let's just... Oh. Let's just do this. It's faster. I have crash th uh, threads.
Hmm. <laughs> Peak meme game. Ow. stop them. You know, if you put that down a couple of seconds earlier, I might have been able to do something about that. So now I gotta try and rotate my commander to go and deal with this. Ooh, this is laggy. Okay, I can't back away from that. I, I need someone to deal with this this problem. Yeah. This is a level of gameplay that is occurring. Like, sure, the invading force was approximately half flank. You know what the real simple solution to this was? That your TDP died? Uh. I think you are correct.
a regal DML a little while ago. I'll probably need a little bit of cheeky scouting at some point. Yeah, he's he's managing to get to a position where he's pushing quite heavily. I really hope that we don't lose our fellow over there to memes. I don't think I can push this either, actually. Oh, I've also lost overcharge. So, me standing under five fucking PVs is a bad idea. I don't have overcharge. Commander under attack. Oh my god. I thought I had OC. I thought I could OC them. What was I thinking? I was thinking I could OC them. And lo and behold, I didn't have fucking overcharge. And in the moment I swap over to go and deal, like, bullet in my base, is the moment my commander steps into the entire back line. Yeah, I should I should have just been patient. I should have just been patient. Like If I if I just waited for my T3 to come off the line, I Why did I do that? <laughs> like, what why? I I had I had T3 in my base. I'm building facilities for it. I'm in a good position. Why did I do that? I just threw the center for us. Yeah, and the other guy took my example of walking into many PDs. I, I, I am so dumb. <laughs> I, I am just so dumb. I don't think there's ever been a moment where my brain went, yeah, sure, this is a good idea. I think they've got, oh no, that's just in T's. I was going to say, I thought Piasma was in this, in this, in the air as well. Ironically, this is on the same tag where John has said not again because, you know, me and overextending is pretty normal. A random thought shared armies mod game. You know, I like that idea because then I can just give everyone my army and I can just go off and die on the front line. <laughs> Uh, 
why did I? No one overextends like Halcyon. No one's got dumbassery like Halcyon. <laughs> I don't know the rest of Gaston. No one fails to build radio radar like Halcyon. Oh, there's no one quite as overextendy. Uh, Floss, you need like lots of TML or TMD. Okay, he's building them. Regal sat with that fully loaded for ages. And as soon as I died, all of the mechs just went. Why? I am... Oh god. Oh right, I was waiting like, what is this? And then I realized that's my base. I was I was wondering like when this came from. <laughs> that's it's me. Time it took blue to build one mixing your base, John has hoovered it up. Yep. Oh, there's a Yathatha. Hmm. There's a hostile Yathatha. How's this Alex going? This guy is. Hmm. No, John's got. Oh yeah, John's only has one. One, one from my base, two from other things. We've got Amsterdam's got a chicken. I mean, got a monkey lord, which is not going to win versus a chicken. Uh. I think we're probably going to win air or this. Not that that matters much. So what can we do with it? Like, that's the big thing. I suppose strap bombers are a good deal. Or T1 bombers, maybe. They're not using the chicken very offensively. Which may be because they've seen the... The monkey? Or if they haven't, they've definitely seen it now. Done with the washing machine. Now I'm grilling. 
Congratulations on grilling. What you grilling? As as the comedy goes, what's cooking good looking? Wolf? Why are you grilling wolf? chickens. Uh, I suppose this breaks their front question mark. Hey. Why? We just lost our entire force for no reason. <laughs> yes. Do not be like me. Do not overextend me. What is this stealth unit? It must be a little radar blip. Like a little uh T1 scout assisted to the thing. What 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 are you? Look Dead! <laughs> Dead is what it was. <laughs> Ooh. Alcy overextended. It might be more possible than you think. I okay. Look, I give you a guarantee. It was a beetle. I give you a guaranteed. I will overextend. Uh, did you have a fatal flaw? Okay, look, you can't ask the guy who walked face first into... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... T2 PVs and thought I could overcharge them. A foolish man. Brave, but foolish. You overextend and, and you can't. Well, I overextend and you can't air. Yes, I overextend because I am the land player. You want the air player. You're the other land player. I mean, I don't think that's enough to one pass the Tsar. Yeah, no, it's dead. Maybe not? Yeah, they don't have enough to fight it, not when we can project with it, but we can't push with it anymore because it's too low health. Wrong person, Jonas. <laughs> Stop trying to type to me. <laughs> I'm already a potato. I know. I'm the Simba Chippy. See, I think... I will be... a living example of what not to do... between the 15 minutes to the rest of the game. Do you see that base over there? You see those PDs? Don't walk your commander at them. It's a bad idea. You better the shelf for your body when you're not using it. And that guy just quit. Okay. And 
well-known fact, almost all iguanas cannot reproduce asexually. Uh, oh, okay? This information that iguanas cannot reproduce asexually. I I I what? <laughs> I've I've never got sort of the possibility that they might be. Scare your spouse during pillow talk. I, I don't have a spouse, and I don't plan on getting a spouse. Oh, but you thought I survived. Bitches? Well, I mean... I suppose the answer is no, no bitches, because of... Obvious reason. The chances of you dying to a parakeet is low, but never zero. <laughs> ah, yes. Death by small pigeon. Or death by colourful pigeon, I should say. I think this is statistic, which is something along the lines of um, more people die to cows than they die to to sharks, which to me is a very amusing statistic. And porcupines make great for meals if you are. If anyone was going to die to a parakeet, it would be healthy. I, I want to say you're wrong, but you know what's going to happen? I will be flying somewhere. I'd be flying somewhere in the world, right? And they would be a bird strike and it's a parakeet but the parakeet what would happen is the parakeet would just like fly into the window where I am and I just get like sucked out the out the airplane yeah sharks get about a, a lot of bad rep jaws get a lot of phobia yeah like so jaws was um jaws was recorded in South Africa in False Bay? I think it was False Bay. And while when it was recorded and then shortly after, South Africa had to shut down beaches because here in South Africa, we do get shark attacks. Those great whites are a genuine threat. And people were going into areas where they were known to be great whites that did attack people. And they got freaking attacked by sharks. <laughs> and that just kind of added to the problem. But of course, you go there now, and there are people who will dive with the sharks and pet them. The events that inspires Jaws occurred upriver in New Jersey. Upriver. This is also one of the things that's terrifying about sharks. You hear statements about them, and you don't ex like you don't expect that to be the scenario, right? We also get shark attacks inland because they swim up up like the um, 
the Amgheni River. And no one expects a shark to be in fresh water because you always you always hear stories of it being yeah, shark attacks are like sharks um Shark attacks, like you don't ex you don't expect to hit it up river. That's where my brain's going, and then it's like, ah yes, a shark attacked me where? One thousand five hundred kilometers from the ocean. Yes. Great. <laughs> I think one of the um one like one of the weird factoids about aquatic life that I find very amusing is did you know that orcas, also known as killer whales, are natural predators of moose? You've made a deal with the sharks, you stay out the ocean and they stay have the land, and we get along just fine. I mean I agree with that. Yeah, and sharks aren't malicious. They will bite because they they're curious, or because it it looks like food. But once they determine that it isn't food, they go away. Like they don't like the taste of human. Yeah, because it turns out that um, moose will graze on kelp in rivers. And uh, well. It turns out, Killer Whale says, Hello Moose, you're a tasty snack. The moniker Killer Whales refers to them being a killer of whales, not a whale that kills. I mean, so the thing is, they're kind of both, right? Like, of a large majority of the animals in the ocean, I am genuinely terrified of orcas and dolphins. They are assholes. The internet is under attack by sharks. Yes, this happens very frequently uh, offshore in South Africa. Anything that's about big enough to mess with the moose and come out alive? Possibly. Why do people be fighting in front like it's full share on? Because I'm used to playing full share. And I aggressively potatoed. Like that's that's my genuine reason. I I genuinely just aggressively potatoed. Ah yes, how's your disconnected reason to shark ate the internet? It's happened before. So a couple of years ago, um Strategic launch oh, detected. Wait, what? What? What 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 what? Oh there's a nuke. Like, if I had, if I had stayed alive, I think this game might have gone differently. But I, I fucked this up. Like I, I recognize I threw that so hard. I, I, I. Like my thought was I can go and overcharge it, but my brain didn't even consider the fact that I've got what. 12,000 HP, and not even 12k full, like, I'm 8,000. And it's not like I can dodge it. And I just walked into it and only realized after I got shot the first couple of times, oh, I don't have enough OC for this because my overcharge has died. And it's just like, I'm an absolute potato. I, I just potatoed that. 
If I didn't mess up that game, wouldn't have been the same. Oh! So explicitly, if I didn't walk forward into all of the space, yes, it would have been very different. Because I had a full T3 set rolling. I have sniper bots. I could have dealt with the Yafatha. I could have broken the bases. It would have meant that none of this happened. And I... I'm a dumbass, is kind of what it came down to. My brain went, oh, my commander's strong. Spoiler, it wasn't.